Hello and welcome back to episode 577 of the Journey Through Games, playing almost every Super Nintendo game released in Europe and the US, just missing out the sports games. And today we are playing Ultima Runes of Virtue 2. Uh, so I've... I've heard of Ultima. I don't think I've ever played an Ultima game. Um, so this will be interesting. All oh, right. Okay. So, who do I get to pick one of these, or do I get all of them? Uh, Shamino. Let's go with the fighter, right? I think. He enter your name. Uh, I like the music. Music's pretty cool. Uh, let's just check my voice volume. Yep. <clears throat> okay. So just move that a little bit closer. Because I did notice that some of the other uh, recordings that I've done, the voice was a little bit quiet. So, um, yeah. Okay. J. T. M. Yeah, the music is cool, isn't it? Good. Oh, easy for sure. Right. Is that Shredder? <laughs> I'm bored. Alright, I guess you are. I have not had fun since I last terrorised Britannia. I know. I shall kidnap Lord... Tholden. Oh, he looks... That should really annoy Lord British. Oh, here he is. Look, he's coming to... Lord Tholden, tis folly to resist me. Uh, Lord British will send someone to rescue me. I would not count on it. He does look evil, doesn't he? That that face. Mm, here we go. Oh wow, he's got like a teleporter. Okay, so he's locked him. I guess I'm mayor of Britain now. I guess you are, chap. Troll, come here. Oh. Guard this room. Okay. Meanwhile, at Lord British's castle. That is a weird looking floor, mate. You need to get someone to sort that floor out because it looks... Freaky. My lord, the Black Knight, we must summon the Avatar to rescue him. Lord British has got some fine beard and flowing locks on him. Very well, my lord. Poof. Oh. Oh, there's Shimino. The Avatar. Oh, right. So it's actually quite... It moves quite well. Lord British, we have summoned thee to Britannia to rescue our Lord Tholden, whom the Black Knight has kidnapped. Lord Tholden is held prisoner in the Caravan of Hatred. Sorry, in the Cavern of Hatred. The Caravan. Cavern of Hatred, due north of this castle. Once thou hast returned him to the city of Britain, return here. Okay. Ah. Okay. So it's like a like a stand like an action RPG. Right, let's see. Uh, a food. Armor. A food. What is this? A magic ank. Ah, so that teleports me back here. Okay. Right, let's let's crack on. So 
so I, yeah I've I, I don't think I've ever played an Ultima game before that's interesting is that is that supposed to happen can I look in here or yeah his floor is weird that that design it just looks creepy and the the sort of top down isometric view is a bit weird bit weird uh, what's this oh wow wait what can I do there so that's where Okay, I can just see. I don't actually, I can't actually teleport anywhere, I don't think. So you walk into things to, to activate them, rather than clicking on them. This is interesting. Imagine a parallel universe where there was no such thing as Japanese RPGs. But this was the, the RPG template that sort of modern games were based around. I suppose to some degree they are but it, it just looks so different also as well that looks like a secret passage there um, no but it looks so different to a, to JRPGs just the way in which they work and the mechanics that's odd Sherry the mouse. I'm Lord British's official cheese tester. Okay. Anything I can do in here? Can I play the piano? I can, yeah. That doesn't sound like a piano, though. Hmm. Is that the same ank as this one? Ah, so the magic ank like takes me to the last kind of scene change, I think. Possibly. Any food there that I can have? Can I talk to anybody? Is that a jester? Chuckles the jester. Hey, ho, hey, my hum. Do you have a clue? No. Then go and get one. Yes. You do? I have one too. Hmm. Cooper the blacksmith. Dost thou ha oost dost thou hast need of a shield? Gladly I would sell you one for fifty gold. Yes. Thou hast not the 50 gold. Okay. So I need 50 gold because a shield I think is going to be very useful. Ah, right. Okay. So this tells me there's something in the moat outside. There's a couple of, there's three people that I can kind of talk to, I guess. Mistal the wizard. In this crystal ball, many things I see. I see the chalice in the cavern of selfishness. Right, okay, so oh, I'm not talking to the the fool. Oh no, I did by accident. So let's see. Do I get any gold for that? So this is the overworld, right? Yeah. Oh gosh. Ah. Oh wowzers. Lord British, thou hast fallen in battle. Wouldst thou continue with thy quest? Continue. Yeah, okay. Hmm. Is this the place where I'm supposed to go? In here? Oh, and it's crashed. No, it hasn't. No, it hasn't. 
Mm, that's pretty cool. The Cavern of Hatred. Uh, let me just have a quick look. Is this Ultima 2? Ultima 2. No. So Ultima Runes of Virtue 2. Ultima Runes of Virtue 2 uh, for the Game Boy. A port for the SNES followed in 1994. Okay. So it's not the sequel. Uh, action adventure game similar to The Legend of Zelda. Right, okay. <clears throat> Wait, what? So. Wait, I thought it was the Caverns of Hatred was where I was supposed to go, right? The Cavern of Hatred. Is this where I was supposed to go? I thought it was. But why can't I? Ah, oh, right, okay. That's a doorway. <laughs> Do I get any gold for killing these folks? Are they statues or are they actual people? I don't know. So... Oh, okay. So that's what that is. Okay, yeah, it is very similar to Zelda then. Oh, gold. Oh, wow. Get out of it. Get out of it. So I got one gold piece for that. This, um shield is looking a long way off. Oh, what were they? Mm. This floor again. What is it with this place and this floor? Like, people get in Oh no. Do I get any experience points for killing? Oh, is that a diamond? I will take that. Oh, okay. Only that was only worth 5 gold. It was a massive diamond. Did you see the size of it? It was only worth 5 gold. Oh, what are they? Is that something I can get? Hmm, doesn't seem like it. I've lost two hit points. Okay, this chap is telling me to go back. Ooh. Hmm. Okay, okay. Seem to have explored this part. Ooh. Ooh. Mm. I am going to have some food. Oh no. Okay, I'm not wasting my time with those. Just re Hmm. Assign the easy way.
That's the easy way. Why can't I take the easy way? Mm. Well, okay, so there's a portal. Uh, that is that the way I came? Yes. Ah, but that no. Okay, should have saved that. Hmm, that's not ideal, is it? Oh, there's a rat. Did I get it before it got me? And is that a key? Mm hmm. So, I wonder if that is going to take, if I have to go the easy way, use that key. Perhaps, yes, because it had a heart on the door, didn't it? That may make some degree of sense. Uh, but where was it? Uh, up here. Oh, God, they can... Whoa, that's, that's crazy. Uh, no, okay, so let's go down there. Where was it? Ah, oh, it was here. Wait, I got the key. Ooh. Why can't I go in that door? Hmm. Maybe it was this door that I could use the key. Okay, one gold piece. Wonderful. Uh, I thought I got the key, right? Let's go back and make sure I... Oh, there. Okay, that. There. That's the heart. Hmm. So, I wonder, have I not picked up the key or something? No, I did pick it up. blocks. Yeah, you can. So how do I get in here? Hmm. Gone online, quickly have a look. Uh, da, 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 da. The Cavern of Hatred, shoot the four bats, touch the arrow. Uh, hourglass is done the easy way. Inside the northern room, go down the ladder. In the east room, along with a snake, is a heart for you. Read the sign. The southwest room holds a portal, step into it, kill the rat, take the big heart key. In the room with the sign, past the heart is another fake wall. So wait, what? In the in the east room, along with the snake, is a heart. Read the sign in the south room, the easy way. The southwest room holds a portal. Step into it, kill the rat, and take the big heart key. In the room with the sign, move past the fake wall for a heart. In the room with the sign, move past the fake wall for a heart. Hmm. Hmm. 
Let's go to YouTube because that doesn't make sense. Or at least I don't understand that. see what YouTube's got to say. Mm. Okay, so he's in that first room. He's just done the... Uh, Okay, so he's here. He's gone down there, into there. So he's just gone on the portal for the first time. So you collect the key. Now he's just moving the boxes all around. That's a bit weird. Hmm. Wait, according to this, he's got the heart key in his inventory. What has happened? So have I used the heart key then, or have I lost it? Has it been taken off me by... Ah. That's a bugger, isn't it? So where did... Oh, so let's retrace my steps. Did... Where is that heart key? Is that all of them dead? He's got the heart key in his inventory. So he then goes here. Where's he going? He's not he's not actually going through the heart door. No, something's gone wrong. So he for some reason that heart key was in his inventory. It's not in mine. And um he then went through the uh, what's the word? The Not the heart door that's behind the fake wall. The one where the sign is that says the easy way. So he went through that door there. But, so where's the heart key then? If it's not in my inventory. Let's have a look. Mm-mm. <clears throat> Snares. Well, 
Why? So I, the heart key was here, right? And I, I picked it up, but it's not there. So where did it go? Is it a glitch, or have I done something? So I can't go through here, and I also can't go through there, it seems. If I can I quit? If I go back up here and then die. So do they steal things from me then if they don't? They don't hurt me. Every time I touch that, continue. So let's see where do I continue from. Wait, what? Okay, the easy way. So that was weird. Like up here. Like I can't get out. Is that intentional? That is weird if it is. Okay, so let's see if the heart key is there. Oh, God. So there is the heart key. Yeah, now it's in my inventory. It's still there. Something went wrong last time. I don't quite know what, but it wasn't in my inventory, which is peculiar. So then this guy went in here. I wonder if you can also... So that used it. You can't use I wonder if you have to use it one or the other. Let's go down here. Hmm. Oh, wowzers. Okay, that's what that... Oh, no, it's only one. That's a bugger. Nope. Mm-hmm. Oh, it... Oh, they... They, like, multiply every time you attack them. That is cheeky, that is, isn't it? Let's go back down here, up here. Meanwhile, at the bottom of the Great Stygian Abyss. Wait, what? Lord British has summoned the Avatar. Hmm. 
I wish I had an avatar to summon. Oh, I know what will keep the avatar busy. Gonna kidnap every mayor. Oh, right, okay. In for a penny, in for a pound, I guess. <clears throat> He's just chucking bombs in. I do hope you enjoy your stay with us, Witsaber. Oh, right, okay. Oh, wait, what? No. Something peculiar is going on here isn't it because like I go downstairs and then you go back up them and they're completely changed like now I can't get back out or last time I um I got blocked in by freaking uh, palm trees I could do with that These boys look dangerous, look. They're big boys with... So I guess I can just keep going down and down and down. Down, down, baby. Mmm, no. Ah, okay. That was... Oh, wow, there's loads of these guys in there, isn't there? Come on, hopefully at the end of this there'll be some health. Some health in here, perhaps? Oh, no, money. Just one coin. Hmm. Right, okay. Let's go down. I needed that. I need more than that, in fact. No. Whoa. Did him. Did him. That's how we roll, son. We be rolling, rolling. Oh no, it's the uh, Sherry the Mouse. Make sure you pick up all the hearts. Okay. Why? Why do you want me to pick up all the hearts, eh? Right, okay. Let's crack on. Ooh. So do you reckon I need to pick them all up to progress? Is that it? Mm-mm. Make sure you pick up all the hearts I have done. Mm. 
No, okay. Is he pointing that way? Ah, there we go. Oh, I see it. Bit of a bit of a Zelda pushing puzzle here. Statue turned into a ladder, silly. Ah, okay, okay. Mm, no, didn't need to get that. Oh no, you don't want to attack them because they multiply, right? Yeah, they do. Okay. So, how can... Wait, what? I picked up the mushroom? You can pick up the mushrooms? Did I pick up another one earlier? Oh, there's a... Uh, these doors are appearing all over the place. This game is like out. Uh, I wonder. I don't even know what the stars do. Speaking of which, I know what my axe does. And my axe. <laughs> quit for now yeah that's gonna be I would say that's another decent discovery uh, we're doing pretty well we're on a bit of a run at the moment um, yeah it's I see the Zelda influence it's obviously got very strong link to the past Zelda influence but like that's not a bad thing um, on the Super Nintendo especially like trying to emulate one of the best games on there uh, yeah so that'll do it for Ru Ultima Runes of Virtue 2 I'll see you guys next time